Let's see what Hamish puts in his smoothie. Look at those arms. What? What? Peel the plus. Nice ring. Cheers. Ready guys. It's my new party trip. I'm gonna have two of these two. We just brought these out. Apple cider vinegar vitamin C wellness gummies. They're so yum. They actually really yum. And they don't disintegrate in your oh, they don't disintegrate in your mouth like half the other gummies out there. Yeah, they um, actually taste more like lollies. Little apples. No. Just have two of them, they're real good. I can confirm they're delicious. And, oh, that's your one. And yep. there's no more, um, what do you call it? Avocado, is that? I don't think so. There's some kale and stuff in that. Bag. Oh, I can add that, yeah. And top it up with water. I don't think so, eh? You won't like that, Zeus. Yeah, you're looking away. <laughs> He's like, I heard you say the word carrot. <laughs> well, that way it's here. No, I dropped an almond before and they're both like sprinted in here. What can you see? What can you see? Uh, Show them the colour. Look at that bench, super dirty. Yeah, tell oh, me about it. Oh, you shut up. I've added way too much water. Doesn't matter, it'll be fine. Here's the color of my smoothie today. So I've been to the gym and today it's pretty much going to be an editing day again. These thick straws are the best for smoothies. Oh my god, I made way too much. I put too much liquid in. Hmm. My eyes are stained from yesterday's makeup too, which is real cute. Pears are a game changer in smoothies. Pears, kiwi fruit, or fijolas. They're all good. Oh, at our section, I'll show you on Friday. We're gonna go up on Friday afternoon. It's currently Thursday, so tomorrow. But yesterday they were pouring concrete at our section. So that is so exciting. So I'll show you tomorrow. It's gonna be good. Oh my goodness, it is windy. The foundation has kind of started, the concrete's not down, but I'll just show you an update anyway. I'm just here showing my mom because she hasn't seen it yet. She hasn't seen the land since it was bare. So, yeah, I'll show you. All right, so here's where we're at. Lots of steel, and you can see there's like plumbing going in. Like if I show you, oh, I'll show you when we get around. You can see a bit of plumbing there, and then there's this big, huge pipe just there that's a lift, hydraulic lift, just, you know, because we plan on being here for a long time, just have a lift for accessibility, or if we sell it or whatever. Um, and also great to chuck the groceries in, so you don't have to carry them upstairs. Nice little touch. Yeah, mum's very excited for us. It's really cool. I guess the concrete just gets poured into this. And you can see where the load bearing walls are. These big, huge things. Mum's freaking like falling in the mud. See, so look at this sucker, because it's hydraulic. Controlled lift. And then you can see plumbing there. Which I think that goes up to upstairs, maybe. And then downstairs toilet and bath and shower and all that over there. Ooh, beautiful lighting right now, putting it on. Oh my goodness, good morning. We're in the shed, we're about to go to the land. And I'm so tired, holy crap. Um, they're pouring the slab really early today. It's raining, so I don't understand how they can do it. But apparently it's going ahead. So we're gonna drive across and just see it being poured. The things I do for my vlog, oh my God, I'm tired. It's so early. It's like before 7 right now and I'm sorry but like you don't see me out before 7.45 right? I'm tired. I've dressed in my gym gear just in case I can like make it to the gym after this but I'm pretty freaking tired. I had a bad sleep anyways. I'm complaining a lot but I'm excited. <laughs> I still understand how they pour it in the rain but yeah. Woo! 
should be good. I'm just, I just wanted to like get a quick shot of it for you guys and just for my memories as well. Um, so yeah, off we go. So it's all being poured, which is cool. So we've got the uh, base going in there. How do you zoom in? No, no. We're all pouring it. And that's been done over there. So they're still going, they'll probably be here all day. Good morning, so I thought I'd just have a quick catch up. Um, life has been crazy. I don't know, I was talking about this on Twitch the other day when I was doing a quick live stream. I was like, does anyone else just feel like October, November is just so hectic. Like, I don't know. I feel like it's just ramping up for Christmas, like the end of the year is like approaching. Everyone starts panicking. Work's crazy. Like I have so much extra work to do. And then it's so beauty and stuff as well. Our build, like there's just been a lot happening. So yeah, but we're getting there. We're getting through it. I've just um, washed my hair, blow dried my hair and Fake tanned. This top, by the way, I've worn quite a few times on my Instagram stories and every single time I get DMs about it, which is so random because I actually think it's the ugliest top ever. It's just so comfy. But I got this from um, Cotton On and I was actually looking for pajamas and there was like none. Our local Cotton On is like bare bones. Like there's nothing there. And my theory is it's just like COVID. Like a lot of shops just seem to have like no stock. Like me and Hamish went into town as well um, like a week ago because they needed some new like tops and jeans and stuff. And there was just like nothing like all of the shops just had about half the amount of stock as normal anyway i'm going off on a tangent so yeah i went to cotton on because i was trying to find pajamas and there was no pajamas that i liked at least but there was these tops and i was like these look like pajamas so i'm committing and i just love it for like around the house because it's huge it's like super oversized and super comfy like it's just the dream but i do think it's ugly but i don't know i vibe it <laughs> anyone was wondering and i got matching shorts too which i can't even see when i'm wearing them because the top is so long <laughs> it like covers where the shorts go to but yeah how have you guys been what have you been up to today i am uh just doing a little bit of work a little bit of chill just kind of regrouping that's why i thought i'd pick up the camera went to the gym this morning got a workout in um it's Guy Fawkes tomorrow, I think. Last night, people were letting off fireworks and the dogs were freaking out, so it was cute. And then tomorrow, we have a meeting with Nicola Ross, who is our, like, kitchen designer and, like, interior kind of designer vibes. She's helping us pick out heaps of stuff for the inside of our house and, like, the colours and how to all look and even guiding us with colours for the outside and stuff as well. Like, we just love her getting her opinion. We're actually meeting up with her at her shop in Foxton tomorrow which would be fun. So I will 100% vlog that for you guys. Um, I don't know if that'll be my next vlog or this vlog. It depends like how much footage I've got so far. I need to sit down and edit this later. So yeah, oh, my arms aching from holding up this camera. The camera's quite big and I got vexed the afternoon before yesterday. So like it's barely sore anymore, but just like the camera weight is a lot. So yeah, I'm fully vexed now, which is good. Um, I'm hoping Auckland gets out of lockdown soon. I have some friends up there I miss and uh, yeah, I just feel for everyone up there that's been in lockdown for ages. So fingers crossed, um, you know, the vaccination rates get up and you know, everyone's safe. Honestly though, this is so heavy, so heavy. I thought I'd show you this package quickly. Oh my God, our kitchen bench is a mess. It's a wipe down. I'll wipe it down first and I'll show you this package that PlayStation sent me. sent me a gift, which is the new headset. Look, so generous, how games were made to sound. So, 3D audio, surround yourself in incredible soundscapes with a headset designed to take full advantage of the PS5 consoles. 3D audio tech with a fine-tuned frequency response to help you precisely place sounds in exact locations. So it's got dual microphones, crystal clear voice capture through two integrated noise cancelling microphones, and it's got EQ presets. So yeah, it's really cool. It looks really sleek. Like it looks beautiful. Look. 
so yeah um and then i finally before i go do some editing just want to make some toast okay i have been obsessed again with um avocado and tomato on toast oh it's been my go-to every single day so that's gonna be it see how like what i mean about how long this shirt is it is huge and i've got my skims on underneath these pajamas are the softest material of life come here do you say hello oh careful he just walked into a bear box lily turned eight the day before yesterday too didn't you do your birthday boy Yes, you were. Yes, you were, but you're still a big baby. But I got one avocado left. And it feels dicey. Might be too hard. But let's chop it open. Oh, it's actually pretty good. I was just trying to chop that with the wrong side of the knife. Just like that, the bench has crumbs all over it again. Live, laugh, love. Bomb. I'm gonna go eat and edit. So, I'll chat to you guys later, I guess. All right, that toast was, oh, I've got crumbs on my mouth. 10 out of 10. Okay, I'm just gonna pop on some quick makeup because I've got to take a branded photo later today. Oh, so I thought I would just vlog my makeup watching a stream. This angle might be terrible, but we will look with it. I will probably check on some falsies later. But yeah, if you've got any questions about what I use, let me know. My brows are kind of average right now because I didn't do my eliminated look that I usually love properly because I forgot. Usually I do that first before my foundation, but I'd already applied it. So I just did a bit more of a sleek brow today. 
but yes i haven't done any highlighter because i don't know i've been loving a really matte look sometimes and like the cream blush just gives a little bit of a glow anyway so yeah all right time for me to go do some more stuff man oh okay i'm feeling a little bit overwhelmed with my to-do list today i think i'm procrastinating by vlogging a little bit but that's okay hello everyone we are just just well we've just got into Foxton where Nicola Ross has her offices because she is our like kitchen designer and kind of like just interior designer kind of and we're looking at a whole lot of textures today so um, carpets like kitchen cupboards tiles um, tapware like just heaps of stuff like that and getting her advice so definitely going to do some vlogging and show you guys what we're kind of like going with um so yeah just hoping to really make some decisions today bit of an average day today a little bit of blue sky over there but it's kind of miserable as well but yeah i'm so excited and i know lots of you guys are looking forward to seeing kind of like the inside finishes we're choosing so you'll get to see a bit of that today <laughs> so it was sort of like an overview I'll show it more as we actually like oh, nice. look at it closer holy yeah, really these are like the little like mock-ups that Nicola did <laughs> oh my gosh this is like so much more detailed than I thought yeah, it's, <laughs> it's so cool okay I'll show you guys as we look at them together I, know, I like the look of all of it I think I like this um tile you like this tile better than that do you yeah I don't I can't choose so. you can't choose thank god you're here but I like them. We like yeah. these kind of. Oh, it doesn't, doesn't look right through right camera. It looks way more orange, orange on camera. It's like a very greyish color. Yeah. Yeah. That's gonna. Would you would you prefer? This is a this or that question. Mhm. Mm so is this for the? So this is for the base unit in this gallery. Yeah. And then the upper units will do white mm -hmm. or lighter color. So do you like this or that? Do you like? I know so one's one. a little bit more gray. Eh? I'd probably do the yeah. less stark one. Yeah, I said that. You did? Yeah, 100%. Before you even see anything. Yeah, happening. I think that one just looks too clinical. Sweet. It's called Meringue. Meringue can't be clinical. <laughs> 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 yeah, no, that's cool. Yeah. Where, where does that go? Sorry? This is the like upper cabinetry in our scullery thing. Oh, in our cool. pantry. So, so like the bottom cabinets will be the same all through, but then. Yeah. Those would be the upper. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Because there's a small room as well, like the lighter can Yeah, it all And then yeah. yeah. stuff's really colourful anyway, so if it's dark, it just feels a little bit. Yeah. Bad. Yeah. More like a cupboard. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Cool. So, so far we've nailed floor tiles, uh, like tapware, um, bar cabinetry, so inside the bar, which is. Yeah, your pitch. Yeah. Oh, it's here. Like inside cabinetry and then outside cabinetry handles which kind of sit like like that yeah. and then I love this bench top which is a little bit lighter than what we were envisioning eh but I don't know I love it yeah it still looks good and then tiles for the backsplash and the little bar which go we through here so the ones we're gonna do see what people actually like so we were gonna do well Pen. these were in the mock-up oh and these here? will go this way so they'll be like vertical okay. um try and zoom in can you see it yeah. So there they are on like a mock up. I don't know if you can see that. But we're just like Pretty freaking choose. out. So we've gone that, but we're going a dark. You can tell color. I like squares. <laughs> yeah. We're looking at our ensuite now. So, like, wait, was this? Yeah, walls. Was that? Walls, walls yeah. yes. Wall tiles, and then not this one, but something similar, like a really dark color. Like, on some of the walls, like making it real moody like this. And then we actually really liked this bench top, which is probably lighter than the picture, but it's beautiful. Yeah. And it's got a little texture on it, it's hard to see. But yeah, that was really nice. And then from our bar in the kitchen, we really like that for cabinetry. So I think we'll do that for our cabinetry and our ensuite. And we've got some different shelving that we've got at the very top. And I think we're considering one big mirror as well. Me and Hamish saw one we really liked, so it's all coming together. Just a little bit nicer. Hmm. I like the thickness of it. It's just that one's quite a lot lighter. It is, even through the camera, like that one matches with that kind of. Yes. Oh no, that's a shiny. Yeah, so maybe. Yeah. This is for our downstairs guest bathroom. 
Once again, this looks so orange through the camera, it's not, I promise. It's actually really like almost grayish, but we're thinking of doing like the finger. Once again, those are like vertical. And then bench top from our ensuite. And then this kind of on the walls that those ones aren't. So yeah, this is kind of the layout and spo. But then with like the different colors and everything. I don't think I like that, Shan. Do you mm -hmm. like that? That yeah, so you don't like the secondary colour, right? I don't really like that. I, I don't know, something about how that's all its all over the show too. Yeah. You know, nope. Yeah. That looks old, I think. Yeah. That just puts you off the whole brand. It looks like cream. Not, like, why would they choose that colour for this? I don't know. <laughs> looks like dog peed on the carpet. Yeah, if you want to hide <laughs> that, I guess. It's too, and they're too little. Yeah. These two are probably the best, like bigger, that's more square, that's more circle, and that's fine as well. But probably... Does this um, wear good? Yeah. Okay. Out of these two. All right. We just need to see. What do you like? Hmm? I don't know. Because even that's fine. I don't mind any of those. This is where we've been, by the way, guys. I realised I didn't really say goodbye after the last section i'm literally editing it as we speak and i'm about to do some more vlogging so hello and goodbye i hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog and there are more coming <laughs>